Our final rehearsal was amazing. We just kind of did the damn thing, to be honest. Um, there wasn't, there was just adjustments to everything and everybody just kind of going with the flow, doing it improv style, like jazz, which um, we had a, you know, a skeleton for the choreography. We knew what the staging was going to be. We had the lighting sorted. I was still working on the costumes, but um, yeah, we didn't have a lot to do. And this was maybe a day, I think it was on the third, a few days before the rehearsal. And I recorded it because I record everything and send to everybody so they can take a look and review on their own time. Water sound that you hear in this moment. It's very important to point out that one of the composers, S. Wex, um, specializes in sampling and um, kind of layering of sounds. And we were all talking about the types of sounds that would um, come out of this piece, and you know, there were spaces within the music that could be elaborated through like a certain cue and a certain sound. So I actually just went and got some jars while we were at our first rehearsal and I just started pouring water. And that was like a very happy accident, but very pers personal and purposeful at the same time because what I was doing was just kind of going through at, um, and seeing all of these different references to liquids and it made sense to have some type of liquid sound and that is the sound that you hear within the actual piece it's actually water being poured into a glass and then we elaborate elaborated that in um the actual jars and glasses and the liquid transfer between the different types of liquid So I am also no stranger to strange lifts that are very unexpected. And I really wanted this transition to be strong because this sampling is from an interview with Coretta Scott King and we just kind of took this snippet and put it into this repetitive kind of meditative part. I think it works really well. Big ups to the presenters, performers. They were giving us a lot of work to play with as well as the composers and this is the first time we just kind of glued it all together and the finish wasn't really done yet and I had two very capable dancers who could just kind of pick up what I gave them very quickly and it all worked out. Yeah, and that is that. And here we have the finished product. One shot, one night only, you know, three rehearsals. Um, 
plus everything I recorded for everybody to look at on their own and this is what happened it was a very quick tech as well um, we have some minor major adjustments um, for the timing because the music had to build and there's all types of machines that I was not familiar with that I had to kind of time everything out it was supposed to start with him already on stage but we had to add a little bit more time so we had him actually enter which is a really 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 strong kind of method of absorption and it looks really good because then we could play with the lights a little bit and kind of have every character build into the scene which I was really happy with and then we have our little broom crucifix which was really what set off the entire piece for me from the beginning. Our Father, who art in heaven, our Father, who art the heavens, our Father, who art the earth. There's my tutu that I spent all night working our on. Our Father, who art in heaven, our Father, who art the heavens. Our Father? Our Father, who art the earth. Our Father, who art in heaven. Our Father, who art in Our earth. Father, who art the heaven. Our Father, who art in heaven. Our Father, who art the earth. Our Father, who art in heaven. Our, Our Father, Father, who art me. I, I am, am the, the olive. I am meant to be anointed. Between so I really wanted to give space to the, the performers and yet to be I think I am extensions of each other. I so I have the I spacing up against the wall because the wall up against the wall is like a whole thing. But I wanted the dancers to be like an incarnate version of these two people's thoughts. There's my lift that I love. I love the sound Less that it savior. makes. Savior. More black, more black. Less vessel, less vessel. More, more. Water, water. More water. And that, as they say, is that, you guys. Hit me up if you want to see the full video. Um, I'm really proud of this work and I can't wait to get on stage and start working again. It's really sad <laughs> that, um, but also happy that that was one of the last things I did before the pandemic.